What it do, ladies and gentlemen? This your boy, Philly SIJ. Subscribe to the channel if you new. Hit the like button. Now, I used to present the best web series that I used to watch, gangster, comedy, relationship-wise, etc. I used to love watching the web series that they presented on YouTube. I pretty much got part one, part two, part three, part four, part five. Really actually give you a revamp of what I presented in the past and then go into what I'm gonna talk about in this episode. Now, part one, we had money and violence, respect life, the terms, old head, and close friends. No, no, part two, we had Project Heat 848, Dear Future Wife, Pieces, The Hand That Was Dealt, The Lick, and Awkward Black Girl. No, no, part three, we threw in Mayhem, Dark Passages, Lanes, Rock Boy Empire, and Target. Now, on part four, we had AI Shah, The Artificial Intelligence, T Styles, It'll Cost You. That's one of my favorites out of all many of her series that she had on her channel. New Jack TV, which had Ryan All-Star, Tasha Mack, and KP, and they used to do their skits, and they threw a lot of mini web series up there that I believe all, Ryan All-Star had uh, produced. And they got uh, they also have The Lick on there as well, which is a good mini web series movie. It's like a movie, but they got quite a few interesting things on their channel. And then you got The Brooklyn Way, and then we also had Coveted. And he, the guy who created Coveted, have quite a few web series. Now, basically, with that being said, what started to happen with the web series, best web series, one, two, and all of that, is I started to see too much of the same stuff. Not only that, I got copyright striked a couple of times. I had to learn how to do it right and all that. But then I started to be bombarded. I was overwhelmed, and I didn't really know what I was doing. It was still the inception of my YouTube thing that I got going on or whatever. So what I started to see was too much of the same stuff. I like the gangster web series. I like them relationship be Jones. I like the ones that was pretty cool, like that keep you engaged or whatever. You know, YouTube, they got people out here who've been doing this for years and they don't really get the credit that they deserve or they don't get the attention that they deserve. So they need people like me to actually be like, yo, go check that joint out. That's how I be introduced to web series through other people. Word of mouth. So anyway, when I started to do it, I started the gangster web series. I'm not going to say I stopped watching them because the ones I presented, when they come out with new episodes, I watch. I'll be sitting there. I'm still engaged because I know the plot. I know the characters. I know what's going on. But what started to happen, well, I started to see too much of the same stuff. I started to see too much of the, let me give you an example. Young buck growing up in the hood. Somebody died or so he's influenced some way by the street life. He start to engage in the street life, selling crack or whatever, or, or swiping cars, whatever the hustle is. Learn to hustle, then they get robbed. Or the main person get pinched and they got to take over, or they don't, they're like, they get into some drama, or they not for the street life, or they, but whatever. But something happened with some drama, they get robbed, boom. Now they got to get their stuff back or get at the person or whatever. Then they get into some beef, boom, squash it. And then they get back to hustling, boom, beef again, boom, squash it. Get back to hustling, boom, beef, boom. It ain't no Black Mirror type-ish going on, man. Like, I need to see some comedy. Throw some com like that. Like, when when 848 was out, he, like, McCom Mr. McCommodore or Mr. Com McCommodore. I can't get his name right, but Mr. Cop, boy, who be on the internet, making skits and everything he added comedy to it and it always was engaging we always seen there was something up with that web series because he was always funny it was always something going on in that web series but that is what i mean by like different types of like had an original plot it had a nice little scheme going on but they did but i think they stopped because they seen that it was becoming the same thing over and over too web series you gangster web series, they all be the same these days. It got to add some pizzazz to it, add something different. Why can't nobody disappear or something or have a power or something or something that you don't see in everyday life? Or if you're going to do it, do the real, real, real reality of it. Like Money and Violence, when I used to watch that, we used to be engaged because what? The dialogue, characters, the plot, the storyline, like, like, like. The entertainment, the situations, the production was on point. You we, you actually learned from it. I still remember some of the scriptures. Like, yeah, it's on Bible. Some of the scriptures, boy, used to put in those web series that I still remember to this day. You know what I'm saying? You will get a lot further in life with respect than disrespect. My man Rafe, you feel me? Like, 
the stuff that was presented in like web series that had a little bit of uniqueness in it, it, it kept our attention and it kept something unique and it had people watching because they had something different. Not because they all the same. Boom, somebody gets shot. Boom, you get shot. You got to shoot. You get to get back. And like, it's the same thing over and over. At least the ones like Respect Life and stuff, I could continue to watch. And they had unique characters or whatever. And they tried to be do something different, but it all ended up being the same. So I'm not trying to say everybody need to do something. You know I mean, like everybody, it seems like just want to be the boss in the video, in the, in the damn web series. Nobody just want to be a hustler. Nobody can be a worker. Nobody can be somebody who just getting money in the web. It, the web series is, is just all be everybody trying to make it to be the boss. When they make it to be the boss, they have a bunch of losses and, they, and then they show you how much it costs. You know what I'm saying? It's the same story. So I just wanted this. I need to find when I want to continue to do the best web series, uh, uh, I want to continue doing them, but I need to find something different. I need to find something unique. I need to find something that we don't see every day, other than us in the hood killing each other or shooting, and then like you got a few little morals in or whatever. But it's like the MOV era is over. That guy, I mean, when and the people that was pushing MOV was hot, like like was lit. The people was watching it was lit, and they was able to, and it, it was a litmus for a lot of other web series to progress off of that 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 boom right there. It got people watching YouTube web series, but now that's over. Money unruined that. They friendship is, I mean, messed up because of that, and a lot of stuff we seen the downfall of the you know respect life. Uh, uh, you know what I mean, God bless the brother, but I'm pretty sure um um. Uh, um, Mo P, I think his name, yo, he was going through something or whatever, like with my mean is mental or whatever they saying on YouTube. I don't know the brother life and all I know is he presented a good web series that had good plot, good schemes, good people. And I was engaged, you know, so it's like a lot of stuff be going on that we don't know behind the closed doors. They doing this stuff for free as well, you know, so it's like. I like the web series that I already presented, but I now I'm looking for something new. So if I'm going to do a best web series, John, it's going to be something with somebody, a nigga in the hood got magic or something, or like he can make your gun disappear or something, or like dodge bullets. I don't care. Something different other than, you know, sell crack or like, I want a different hustle. Like a, a brother found out the YouTube hustle in the hood and he learned the game or something. Some a web series that's like some, a new hustle. Like a ride share web series. You know what I mean? A, a nigga became a Lyft driver or something and quit his job and then the light got ruined. So I don't you know. You know what I mean? But yeah, I want to see something different. I don't care. It got to be something presented. That's all. You know, I still like web series. Still watch the gangster ones because they is a gangster web series. I know what I'm going to get out of it. But however, I'm just expecting a little too much sometimes. So yeah, that's it for this video. Basically, it's your boy Philly SIG. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Hit the like button. And the last videos, check out them. Best web series, one, two, three, because they still hot. But I'm just looking for something different now, yo. Because like... I done watched them all. Like, and now I'm used to watching like Netflix. So, you know what I'm saying? It got, I now I kind of see like, all right, that's why people don't watch YouTube Webster because it's just like, it's kind of like, it gets bad. People getting kidnapped and everything that I, you know what I mean? Anyway, that's it for this video though. Cause I don't want to go too far. I don't want to offend nobody. Cause I like, I still like the Webster. I still watch the Brooklyn way, Brooklyn way, the shit. You know what I'm saying? I still watch, you know what I mean? I still watch old Money and Violence episodes. Still watch Money Respect, Coldest Winter, you know what I'm saying? I still watch, I'm rewritten Money and, like, oh, man. Money and Violence, all of them joints, man. I still watch. So, yeah, yo. I, I'm out. And y'all got to learn how to do them, right? I might, maybe, I, yo. I might need to come out with a video and don't, like, I'm not trying to be disrespectful, but I see that some people be having problems with their YouTube channel when they come out with videos like that because of the violence and stuff so it's like certain rules that you got to follow on youtube and some of the web series people they don't really be knowing and they they, they get a, they, they the channel taken down or they get videos taken down or whatever so actually know how to do it or like put the put it together and so you can actually get away with some of the stuff in there but anyway I don't think y'all need my help. Y'all can just log on to how to keep your YouTube channel up if you, you know. But if y'all need me to come out with a video like that, I will. And um, peace.
Let me holler, 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 let me holler